In today's lesson, we're looking at ordering numbers, so building on yesterday's work of comparing numbers, but instead of just looking at two numbers at a time, we might be looking at a whole group of numbers. But we do exactly the same thing. We look at the digit to the far left. In this case, all four numbers have a digit in the hundreds column, so we know we need to compare that hundreds digit. And I can see here that we have a 4, a 2, a 9, and a 4. So the largest of those is my 9 in the hundreds column, so I know that that's my largest number. I'm just going to put a 1 above it now for to remind me that it is the, the largest. Now next, I can see I've got two numbers that start with a 4. So that's a bit trickier. I'm going to come back to that in a moment. But I can see I've only got one that starts with a 2 in the hundreds column. So that must be my smallest number. I'm just going to put a 4 to remind me that it's the fourth largest. So again, we've got these two numbers that start with a 4 in their hundreds column. So just like we did yesterday, if that's the case, we look to the next digit to the right to decide which one's larger. So we're now looking in the tens column, and I can see that 9, representing 90, is larger than the 2, representing 20. So that must be my second largest number, meaning this is my third largest number. Now, if we just look underneath here, I've got these two words, ascending and descending. Now, ascending literally means going up, and descending means going down. So you might come across these words in some questions asking you to put your numbers in ascending order or descending order. Now, if they're ascending, you can see just like our mountain, it starts very low and gets higher. So we need to start with our lowest number, which we've decided here, 249. Then the next lowest number, 428, 498, and then our largest number, 942. So you can see here in ascending order, it would be starting with the smallest number and getting larger. If you were asked to put them in descending order, you would be starting with the largest number and just putting them the other way around so they're getting smaller as they go along the list.